everybody. It's about 3.30 on Thursday, August 23rd. This is not the set of a horror film. It is the construction zone for the cafeteria. I'm excited to share with you some progress in anticipation of your return to school. So if you'll follow me down the stairs, which you know well, we'll take a little tour. Okay, stop one. The entryway to the cafeteria may look a little familiar to you. The big difference is, is as you come in, the wall that was here is now missing. That makes a little bit more space into the lower school area and makes for a slightly more comfortable entry into the cafeteria. So follow me and we'll take a look at the lower school side. So these arches should look familiar to everybody. They're what separated the, the lower school side here from the kitchen and the upper si school side over there. Now I'll ask John to do a big wide pan across this space. Keep in mind this is what was the lower school side what will continue to be primarily the lower school side. We're gonna have new drop ceilings uh, that will conceal all of the air conditioning duct work in the ceiling. So the ceilings will be a little lower, especially at the outer edge of the room, but still quite high in the middle and towards the center of the room. So I want us to come down to the end of this room, the end of the lower school side, and take a look at the air conditioning systems and the servery. Okay, so here we are in the southeast corner of the lower school dining room. You'll see that we've given up a little bit of window space for the air conditioning system. Um, I think it's probably going to be a very positive trade-off. You'll also see here in the back of the room that there's a brand new servery that will function to serve this side of the cafeteria. We've never had that before. Um, it's beautiful stainless steel work. It's clean, it's new. Uh, I think it will serve the children's nutritional needs wonderfully. So now let's take a look at the old upper school side. Uh, we're gonna pass through the opening uh, where the, the drink used to be and uh, we'll take a look at that side of the cafeteria. So here we are with the master construction documents, pages and pages that tell our wonderful crew how to do their work on a daily basis. If you think about this space, this is about where the old panini machine used to be. And it gives you an idea of where we're standing. Um, this will be basically seating for middle and upper school students um, instead of the old line. And if John would pan the camera around, you'll see the servery covered in plastic, and now you're looking at what was always seating for middle and upper school students, and it will remain so. Um, the really nice addition is towards the back of the space where we will have a, a closable dining conference area that we hope will be usable for students and meetings and teachers, uh, parents association, and so forth. We've divided the cafeteria into basically four different zones for maximum flexibility. Everything is being outfitted with presentation systems. Uh, we are really thinking that this space will be usable all day, uh, not just for breakfast and lunch, and we hope that it will serve the needs of our students as another place to gather, to study, to socialize, to congregate. May I help you? This is the servery. We peel back the plastic to give you an idea of what it's going to look like. Basically, it's a square here in the middle of the space. Students and faculty and any visitors will be able to approach it from three different sides to get their food. Also an open kitchen and we're hoping to connect students more intentionally, more thoughtfully to their food, the food that they eat every day, where it comes from, how it's prepared. So that's it. We're really excited about the possibilities of the cafeteria. I think it's gonna be an amazing space for all of the community and we look forward to it opening. Right now we are on schedule for an approximately September 20th opening. As you know, we're all gonna be eating al fresco for the first couple of weeks of school out in a tent in the central courtyard. Uh, we're gonna make it fun. It's gonna be like a picnic. It's gonna be a great 10 days that lead up to um, having the cafeteria reopen. Uh, in the meantime, our wonderful cafeteria staff will continue to prepare our food fresh. They'll be preparing it over Xavier and bringing it here each day. We will have a very brief breakfast, full lunch, and we look forward to seeing you back to enjoy it all. Take care and enjoy the last few days of summer.